Hey guys, um, I wanted to come on here and do a little bit of Facebook Friday. I'm not doing live, I'm doing pre-recorded. So um, I hope to hear from each of you. I hope that you'll watch this short video. And this is just to catch up on things that have happened this week and look forward to next week. I know it's still a little crazy because we're not um, visiting face to face, but I look forward to seeing you guys. I've got a little bit of a sore throat, so I've um, got a cough drop, so excuse that. Um, I look forward to seeing you guys real soon, hopefully. So here's what's happened this week. We kind of, uh, Miss ETS Gracie Higgs and I, friend her on Facebook, um, have worked up some workshops. In fact, Miss Gracie did her very first workshop called Financial Literacy this week, and we shared it with our Hoxie students on Tuesday, which was our regular scheduled ETS meeting, and then shared it again um, yesterday with Hillcrest. And we asked that each of you um, complete the form. The link was sent to you, and we sent it through a multiple array of um, formats. For instance, it went through Text Generator. It went um, to you via your email. It was on Remind, and we also put the link up on Facebook. So you have multiple ways of accessing that. I did not get a lot of response back from the students at Hillcrest. So I want you to pick up your game. I know that you guys are getting emails from your school email. And that's the way that you communicate. So I want you guys to, to check on that. So that was on Tuesday and Thursday. We'll be delivering the same message on Monday to Walnut Ridge because that is our scheduled ETS trio day um, for them. And then later on, we'll be at Mammoth Spring virtually on our scheduled date there. So those are some things that are coming up in your school districts. I wanted to reach out with you if you're having a problem getting internet connection. We've got some resources that we can share with you on that. Also be using the Photo Study app to help with those AMI packets. Um, I know doing math and science away from your teacher might be a little bit difficult. And so I really think that Photo Study app can help you if you will um, take advantage of that. So please check on to that. So, Going forward, let me look at the calendar and see what's happening. So Monday, we will be at Walnut Ridge virtually, of course. Um, and then also I am, sorry, I am working on getting some small group Zoom sessions set up with my seniors. I'm going to be, if you've not done your FAFSA, I'm going to be reaching out to you one-on-one. -on -one. But I thought rather than have 30 or 40 kids on here on a Zoom with my seniors, that I would limit that to like groups of five or six of your closest seniors and we would do it that way. That way we have more communication and talk. I know you might have some questions about what you need to be doing to get um, ready for college. And a lot of the colleges are kind of, they're working like we are remotely. And so it's a little different ball game. You seniors um, who are graduating 2020, you are going to have the stories to tell of COVID-19 and how it affected your senior year. I'm very sad for you guys. I know that um, we always like, I can't wait for senior year to be over, but then now that it has come to this and it's disrupting your plans like prom and graduation and all of those things, I know it's really kind of sad. So I'm also going to be working with some of my ETS students who graduated in 2018 and 2019 to get um, a bring back the college freshman and sophomore kind of vibe. Um, if you remember a couple of years ago, at some of my schools, I brought the students back who had just experienced that college vibe and had them do a, um, a panel of, with the seniors, things that they thought they should know. So I'm working on getting that established for the week of the 20th. So that will be uh, probably my senior final meeting. And I will be working with you guys. But stay tuned because, you know, we may get back in the schools. We're all crossing our fingers that that will happen. But I'm here for you. And so is ETS Gracie Higgs and, and ETS Cody Clark if you're watching this from, and you're from one of his schools. So reach out to us. Let us help you. We look forward to serving you. And continued good health to all of you. We'll reach you later. Bye-bye.